We are back on Fortuna. And am I about to fight a Hydra? Probably. Okay, it's got a tail that has a It's a dragon. Please make the neck and tail shorter, Fox. Okay, okay. There we go. That's what I need. That's what I need. Thank you, Peppy. You fighting this dragon? That's laying eggs. Oh. That is not pleasant. Hit him in the mouth. Hit him in the mouth. Suck it. Hit him in the mouth. Hit him in the mouth. Oh. Rock it. Hit oh. him in the mouth. Oh. Hit him in the mouth. Fuck me. Hit him in the mouth. Hit him in the mouth. Smash it. Mm. Oh, you died. I thought he died. <laughs> no. <laughs> I don't think I did any damage to him, actually. You didn't. <laughs> Ooh. Okay, okay, okay. Welcome we, back, We got this. How y'all doing out there in the internet world? <laughs> so, um, I do want to talk a little bit about uh, conventions, man. Yeah. So, um, about a month ago, we went to Animation. I know you didn't go, um, but yeah. I went because I go every year. Right, right. You know, conventions are the one thing in life that... Give me life. <laughs> yes, double laser. Oh, that's cool. So nice we went to uh, Animation, which is in oh. North Carolina, Raleigh, at the end of. How was it to get that? Um, oh god. Sorry, I'm not trying to interrupt. Oh no, you're fine. At the end of May, and um, more of that weekend. So I mean, it's way past that, but I just want to bring it up. Um, but a lot of people were giving this year's Animation a lot of flack. Mm -hmm. um, saying, I heard. Oh, it's not that good. It's just so boring. And I'm like, uh, listen, guys, when you go to a convention, your convention experience is what you make it out to be. Um, I didn't really talk about that much on, um, on online in the groups and whatnot, but I, I feel as though a lot of people were just giving it flat because it was the cool thing air quotations right here it yeah. was a cool thing to do because beforehand there was a lot of people like momocon which is in atlanta um apparently changed their date to the same date or same weekend as okay um, how do i dodge that i don't know how you i thought it was that. between its neck but it did can't all you move that your, can't you move your ship like oh vertical? like that yeah that's probably what i you thought should. i was well enough between them but i mean yeah can you know what i'm about to die anyway let's test this out so yeah, a lot of people gave animation a lot of flat because of uh, Momocon. They were like, Momocon's so much better. Oh my god, we're having so much fun at Momocon. But I'm yes. And I'm like, guys, <clears throat> these are conventions. We don't have time for that. Life is too short. Just go to the convention and have fun. Like, jeez Louise. <laughs> my thing is, I just want, I'm just looking forward to finally going to a new convention, like, as just a personal experience. Like, True. we've gotten to go to a couple as a group now as like v major gaming yeah but like i'm looking forward to because you know like you and the others have gotten a chance to go to some of the other cons now like you guys went to uh what was it necocon yeah we went to necocon in virginia oh, we're actually thinking about going back this year but if we go back if we go there we've got to make sure we get there early on mm -hmm. friday because last time we got there kind of late on friday because some people had to work you know they're nine to five and we had to wait right and then we had right. to drive to um virginia which was like three hours um wow jeez <laughs> tell slap mm -hmm. super tell effective super effective <laughs> <laughs> oh man so mm. go and finish your statement then we can okay but yeah I, well it. i'm just i just want to i just want to be real with you guys like um conventions are what you make them out to be if you're not having fun at the convention make fun legally mm -hmm. yeah <laughs> make make some fun like converse with people even if you don't if you're not really like one of those people who like to talk to people mm -hmm. make an outlet where you could converse with people without conversing with them case in point what we did we bought a bunch of board games and we said hey um, 
you anybody wants to play board games with us, you're more than welcome to. We'll explain the rules. That's what we did. We played uh, One Night at Werewolf mm-hmm. or whatever, and we met so many friends through that. And we did that on Sunday. And let me tell you something. Sunday is the day I normally leave early. We normally leave. The convention doesn't end until 4.30, but we normally yeah. always leave at like 1 because it's like Sunday, it's nothing to do, yada, yada, yada. Plus, it's we one didn't of those leave. things where it's like, oh, well, if we leave now, you beat traffic and stuff like we that. We didn't leave that convention until 5 because we have so much fun with random people we met playing One Night at Werewolf. Mm-hmm. Um, TLDR, um, conventions I know can be crazy and whatnot, and sometimes they do have rules, but keep in mind these rules are to keep you safe. Right. First and foremost, a lot of people complain about too many rules. Hey, that happens. Like, we are in a different kind of world. Like, you've got to follow those rules. It's Everyone's here to have fun, but you've got to adhere to those rules, you know what I'm saying? Because they're, they're there to make everyone safe. It's not just about, you know, you, a 20 seven year old person i use myself as an example mm-hmm. like right you is other people there there's you know kids there's people that are under 18 and you want to keep everyone safe and everyone's having fun two don't rag on a convention especially if you're not there like there was a lot of people who weren't even there that were in the animation chat talking about oh i see i heard i heard man amazing was whack i heard this i heard that and i'm just like well i'm here to tell you i had a blast mm-hmm. i had fun it was nice. It was relaxing. I caught up with old friends. I made some new friends because I knew that I paid for this convention and I'm going to make the most out of it. Yeah. So, yeah, just I just just something I wanted to throw out there. Mm-hmm. You know, um, I know I went on a little bit of a tangent, but still, I think it's something that needs to be said. Right. Um, but we're going to do a quick pause right here. Yeah. And we'll be right back. Yep. Yep. All and right. we're back. Sorry for that little pause. We're going to see if I can uh, not fail this All time. All right. We got to fight. You know who he reminds me of? He reminds uh, me of uh, Doduo. Uh, Doduo? What's the... Doduo? Is that the Pokemon? Doduo? Yeah. I know. Dotrio. Like, Dotrio, I, I can say. But I've always had a problem Do-duo. with the, is how Do-duo. I always pro- That's how I pronounce it. Yeah. yeah. It looks like a Doduo mixed with Blue Eyes White Dragon. It kind of does, yeah. <laughs> how did none of my blasts hit that? <laughs> It was literally right in front of me. So what are you supposed to do? Are you supposed to hit his tail? Peppy told, asked me to try and shorten its neck and its tail. Well, its necks, plural. But, like... Yeah, you. I can't fly between those necks because it will make me hit his body, no matter what. Can you break? I, I have been. It makes me fly right through, like, right through him. I will try, try breaking again. I will attempt it when I get to him. Yep, yep. I mean, I've been trying. Maybe I can. I'm just failing at it. Like, that is a possibility. <laughs> Man, this planet, it looks so, like, I know the graphics aren't the best thing in the world, but when you really think about it, at this time, this probably, like, blew people's mind. Like, this this level alone. Just okay, with there we the, go. Got the double lasers. The plants just coming in and then blooming like that. Yeah. Like, that's, that's crazy. That's actually really cool, but it also is really bad. <laughs> Because it's so hard to dodge them when they just pop up, like, two feet in front of right. you. Right, <laughs> right. Okay. Let's see. Okay, I'm trying to shoot that, too. Jeez. Breaks, 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 and I'm out of breaks. Yeah. Well, you got tail side. You didn't hit them. Yeah, that time. Like, I'm trying to hit the head. That doesn't work. I'm trying to hit the tail. Can't hit the tail. Because it's constantly moving, which, I mean, that's what a tail does, obviously, so. Right. Gotta try and stay up when he turns around because that's his tail. There you go. You did not get hit. But <sighs> yeah, I know that was just me hitting the ground because. Oh, God. Oh my God, Matt. I've got to stay away from him, or else I get smacked. I think you're supposed to hit the tail. My lasers are not hitting it. Now you are. What? Now you are. Okay. But it said the tail, that was his butt. There's That's two different things, No, game. you were hitting his tail. His butt was flashing. But you were hitting his tail. It was indicating, oh, oh my god. Oh I my was god. not expecting fire breath all of a sudden. I should have, but I wasn't. <laughs> that's cheating. That Pokemon is cheating. Right? You shorten his neck. Now attack him. I don't know where his weak part is. Oh, you're hitting him. You are hitting him. Focus focus on the glowing spots. Just whatever you do, Matt, just focus on the glowing spots. 
Oh my god, he's almost dead. Maybe. He's dead! He probably has another part. I don't trust it. I don't trust it. Not till he's fully dead. Is he fully dead? Is, is he fully dead? I'm not able to shoot anymore. I think there's more level. Nope. No. Okay, we good. Chi all <laughs> those chips check in. Who? Look at you, Matt. I'd not trust it. <laughs> Look at you. You even got a bomb left and some shield. Look at you, man. Who? We're doing good. That was uh, not nearly I'm as so that sad. Was boss. I was so sad. You took the least <laughs> amount of time on my favorite stage. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a little bit. I'm a little bit upset. That just, means I was good at your favorite stage. Uh, go through Sector Z. No, Sector Z is probably gonna kill you. Oh, absolutely. Hey, whoosh. The little shooting star. I, I saw it. Yeah. Your team is doing well, Fox. I hope you're taking good care of my R wings. Go for Macbeth. These are yours. <laughs> These are mine. We are a mercenary group, Star Fox. My daddy be built this team. That is true. Yeah, when, when did he get the rights to these ships? Right. All of a sudden? <laughs> these are my ships. I'm out of my R wings. All right, Matt. Okay, now this is my one. first time through the stage, it's so another, we'll see how well I do. It's another one of those stages. All right. So another thing that's, ha that's changed since last time we recorded what the? is I got another job. And oh, this is not. I know y'all like God, Risa. You change jobs so many times. Look, <laughs> and you aren't wrong. <laughs> I change jobs a lot because things. <laughs> I did get fired from one job, and I just want to throw it out there. I did get fired from one job because I, I was sick, and you couldn't miss any training. Yeah. So I got sick, and I was like, "Well, I can't come in. I can barely get out of my bed." And they're like, "Well, sucks to be you. You are fired." And I was just like, "Really?" So. I got fired from one job, but then I got another job, and that's where I'm at now. And let me tell you guys something. You Ooh. know how I made that promise where I was not going to get another job that didn't require a drug test? Mm. I got a, I got <clears throat> another job that didn't require a drug test. Yeah, how how that and, whole plan work out? <clears throat> no offense to my people that you know take part in recreational, you know, marijuana or anything <laughs> like that. It's just not me. And you can, you can tell a lot about a job if it doesn't, if it does, or if it doesn't require a drug test. Um, my job is extremely ratchet. Um, how ratchet is it? Well, every, I just don't even know where to begin. Um, I'll start with training. Training um, was crazy. Training, uh, the classroom portion of training was five weeks. And in those five weeks, we've had to have four or five sit down talks about attitude and people getting along with each other. Now, <laughs> these are adults, right? These are all adults. You have to be 18 to work there. But they just do not act like it's just so much emotion and just disrespect <sighs> around like these. I, I don't know how else to say, but these females, man. Like, it was me and four other dudes um, in that class. And I say was because all the other dudes have been fired. And I am the lone survivor. I have won survivor. <laughs> I was not going <laughs> off the freaking island. <laughs> I am still here. But, um, yeah, so they these a lot of the things that happened, a lot of issues that we had in this. Um, oh, my God, the slow the, down. Yeah, see. Oh. A lot of issues we had in training class was because these females and their attitudes. And can I just say, like, ladies, and if it doesn't pertain to you, if it doesn't, if it doesn't, you know, apply, let it fly. So if it doesn't pertain to you, then don't worry about it. But if it does pertain to you, just because somebody is talking and looking maybe in your general direction doesn't automatically mean they're talking about you. And that's 90% of the arguments and fights that happen in my classroom was people wow. were talking. And you know how when you talk, I know for a fact when I'm talking, I look around. Yeah. And I may lock eyes with somebody, but that's not on purpose. I just do that because I'm weird <laughs> like that. Yeah. But I don't, I'm not oh. talking about cheese. Oh. Uh, you're taking damage? You are... Dude, I don't know oh. where to go. Like, oh my god. Oh my Jesus, Matt. What was I supposed to do? I don't know. There's a right. bogey on his shit. I mean, his six. <laughs> I hate life. 
But yeah, just, <laughs> just because that's a good soft boy. Um, just because somebody is looking in your general direction doesn't automatically mean people are talking about you. Um, handle things like an adult. Just say, hey, you know, don't talk about me behind my back. You know, yeah. Just, just, just sit down and try to hash things out like an adult. Uh, but we'll go back. And we'll, we'll, I'll go more into this uh, on the next episode. Right now, we've got to end it. Uh, come question of the day. Um, do you love your job? <laughs> I can't. I just. Mm. <laughs> I know that things kind of weird and out of left field. Some people do actually legit love yeah, their job. A lot of people do actually. I do not. <laughs> I don't like it. I just, it's, it's it's just money. It's money so we can get the equipment, do the things to entertain you people, you good people of the internet. Yeah, because um, we appreciate you. Matt, do you love your job? Not this job, but the actual job you get paid for. <laughs> uh, for the most part. I won't say love, but I do like it, yeah. No, I see. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's understandable. Yep. Well, in the meantime, between guy guys, y'all stay sexy. Until next time, see ya. Hit it! Hit it!